Hello. Have you ever noticed the number of trailers that travel on our roads? Perhaps a utility trailer like this one. A builder's trailer. Boat trailer. Jet ski trailer. Snowmobile trailer. Quad bike trailer. Horse trailer, among others. A large number of trailers travel on our roads and the quantity is not often evaluated. There is also the complete range of recreational vehicles like trailer tents, even fifth wheel trailers. However, all of these units have a common flaw. When unhitched, no automatic wheel blockage system stops the unit from moving. Utility and recreational vehicle represent close to one million vehicles in Canada alone. Once unhitched, it is recommended that a trailer be secured with a wedge at the front and the back of the wheels to stop it from rolling if on a slope surface. If one of those wedges should come loose, the slightest shift in the balance of the unit could lift the front crutch and the vehicle would then be able to move on its own and could constitute a grave danger. Following this observation, we have developed a system to block the wheels which can be fitted on any type of trailer. The system is equipped with a sensor that detects if the trailer is hitched to the tracking vehicle or not. By putting a constant pressure on the lever, the operator will create enough space to release or hitch the trailer. A cable links the sensor to the wheels of the trailer. The blocking section is made of two pivots that automatically jam regardless of which way the wheels rotate. Now to demonstrate how it works. This trailer is not hitched and so the wheels are blocked. By applying pressure on the sensor the operator is able to hitch the trailer while disengaging the wheel blocking system. Once again when the trailer is unhitched the blocking system will be engaged. Our system also offers extra security when the trailer unhitches. While in motion the right wheel will be blocked slightly before the left to steer the trailer off the road. In the next footage, you will see a series of static tests. Generally, the road inclination doesn't exceed 5 degrees. If it does surpass this, the Ministry of Transport often indicates the incline and its distance. We are going to demonstrate to you how our system is able to attain an incline of 35 degrees. You will notice that an incline this pronounced will never be found on the roads or any form of parking space. To show the resistance on our system, we have placed upon it a load of approximately 250 kilos. You will also notice that at the front of the platform we have placed a tilt indicator to help visualize the incline. To move the trailer, the operator needs only exert and maintain pressure on the lever and the wheel blockage system will disengage. The next sequence will demonstrate an inverted incline that is just as accented as the first. We have filed a patent and have mandated a firm specializing in intellectual properties to verify all worldwide patents of which we could be in committing infringements. We have received US, German, French, Austrian and Japanese patents and nothing until now 
deals with a sensor that blocks the wheels. There are handbrakes that exist that control braking on a trailer, but only if the trailer is equipped with brakes. No system exists that, like ours, is sold as a kit and can be installed on any trailer on the market. Once again, we have attained an angle of 35 degrees and the trailer has remained stationary. Our system also has a park or run selector. In a slope parking space, the operator will place the selector on park when he needs to couple or uncouple the trailer. Without this device, the trailer could move momentarily when the wheel blockage becomes inactive while the lever is pressed. If the operator fails to place the selector on run, the device will automatically deactivate when the trailer is in motion. For a dynamic test, the truck will attain a speed of 30 km an hour before uncoupling the trailer. For the first test, we will disengage the wheel blockage system. Notice the distance traveled by the trailer and how it is out of control and could bifurcate and hit a vehicle traveling in the opposite direction head first. This trailer traveled a distance of more than 40 meters before being stopped in loose soil. In this second test, while staying at 30 km an hour, our wheel blockage system is activated. Not only will the trailer stop within a very short distance, its trajectory will be controlled so that it will bifurcate off-road. This will avoid any possible danger for oncoming traffic. An American website, dangerousTrailer.org, uniquely compiles the trailer accidents we can see here. On average, since 1975, more than 380 deaths, almost 12,000 injuries, and nearly 44,000 cases of damaged material are recorded each year. We strongly believe that our wheel blockage system could decrease these statistics. Thank you for your attention.